Hi everyone, this is the fifth order from Timu. Fifth, number five. So, I'm excited. I love Timu. I'm finding stuff all the time on there that is just really good, um, good quality and good pricing. So, stick with me and we'll get right into it. don't have my scissors, but I don't really need it, I don't think, because I can kind of just manhandle, woman handle it, whatever that means. Okay, you can see it all comes in the bag. Um, the boxes inside can get crushed. That's the only problem that I have with them putting everything in the bag, but and if it gets open during shipping, it can all fall out. And I have, I hate it when you get a hair on you and it feels like something's tickling you, you know? Okay, first item that I'm doing, it's this little, um, it's, it's, it's a gadget that I can put in a bucket and it'll agitate and t swirl for little tiny delicate clothes um like when we go on what i got it for is instead of getting the actual you've <laughs> i can't think today you know the portable washing machines the little tiny portable washing machines that they have on there for like 30 and 40 dollars um i just got the thing that goes down in the bottom that swishes it and I have a collapsible rubber bucket type thing that you you can collapse down store it and then open, you know bring you know extend it and make it bigger I'm just gonna put this in the bottom of it it's the exact same thing I didn't need all the other stuff that goes with it just you know when you're camping sometimes you don't want to take just a a couple little swimsuits you know to the uh to the laundry pl part of the campground you can just do this in a bucket of course i could just do that with my hands i know but i just thought that was so neat to have a little mini washing machine <laughs> so i'm gonna try it out it wasn't much at all and it will agitate and then I can rinse that out and hang the, the you know, little delicate stuff like the swimsuits and things like that. And it's got suction cups for the wire so I could suction, cup, suction it to the, the wire to the side of the bucket to where it won't um, make a it won't be a problem so that's all I needed I didn't need the bucket I already have one of those so and then here it's got another little suction cup thing that goes on the bottom and it will suction it to the bottom of the bucket so that way this stays put and I was like well you know I don't really need the whole bucket I mean the whole washing machine thing because I noticed it collapses too down to make be be small and this just goes in any bucket it don't have to be one of those collapsible buckets it can go into any kind of bucket so if you wanted a little washing machine uh, you can do that without having to stand there and and do it yourself you could you know you could let it let it run while you're having fun with your family so anyways I thought that was the neatest thing really neat 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 and I didn't have to pay the whole thing because I have my own little got it at Aldi the buckets that collapse down it'll work just fine okay now I got two of these now the boxes are a little mashed mashed and what these are is the multi-function toothbrush sterilizer it holds your toothbrushes you put your toothpaste up here and you you press it and it 
puts the toothpaste down on your toothbrush and then while it's uh, storing storage over here where you put hang your toothbrush it has a UV light so it kills the germs on your toothbrush and it suctions I believe it suction cups to the uh, safety lock can charge it says no need to plug in electricity um, intelli intelligent sterilization no need to punch holes uh, squeezing it squeezes the toothpaste correctly and um, has a smart switch and all so I'm really excited about these I got one for each bathroom and I'm hoping that it will work fine um, I saw another Timu um, YouTuber that got one that just, it didn't have the, okay, I got it right. It didn't have the, the sterilization uh, switch. I mean, the UV light. So, we shall see, and it comes with its little, oh gosh, they've got it stuck up underneath there. Come on out. There we go. It comes with its little charger thing which I have I don't have to have the I I don't have to have this close to an outlet because I do have one of those little charger what you call it the little charging dock things that you you know that you have and it's got the little buttons over here and that's where you put your this little charge thing in and so you put the toothpaste in there and when you go in you're gonna tap that and it's gonna or whatever or either it'll sense it I'll, I don't know but there's like a a thing that's gonna sense when you're in front of it and it'll turn on or something I don't know I will read about it um, and this is how you put it on now I'm gonna put it on my mirror um, so that way you know, I don't have to worry about this. These do pull off the uh, sheetrock, <laughs> the 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 paint and sheetrock off your wall. So if you're going to put this up, make sure you put it in a in a place that yeah. I mean, you could actually put this on here and use command strips instead of the 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 actual sticky of this. So. Um, that's what I, I'm going to do probably well on the mirror it won't matter but that's this thing and I'm going to try to say let's see it can recognize it intelligently recognizes the movement of the human body when it detects someone within a meter induction lights and blue lights will be on at the same time delaying sterilization when a person leaves for two hours the UV light will automatically turn on and sterilize to ensure human health. So while the regular lights are on, when it turns all of its lights on, it's not going to work with the UV. But when you go out and you turn your bathroom light off, the UV light will come on. So um, it's omnidirectional sterilized solar charging. Intelligent infrared detection. Multifunctional, ultraviolet, sterilized tooth toothbrush holders, what it's called. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm very excited about that one. I really am, and I can't wait to get that up and see how that works. I will need to do a review, an update on all the products, shouldn't I? And or go put it up, see how it works, and film that for you, and put it in on this on this unboxing. So now we've got two of those. All right, and let's see what this is. This is what is this? I don't know what this is. It's a little bag of some sort. It's a little bag of something. Oh. 
See, it's got a little hole down here with a little net. See that? That right there, you put your plastic, it's a, tra a garbage, it's a grocery bag holder. So you put all those grocery bags you've got, all, and then you just pull them out from the bottom, and it hangs. I got that for my camper. My little, my little camper, and if you've seen my, my video where I was doing the, checking out the diamond painting glue, it's a couple videos ahead of this one on my channel. Uh, I show my garden while the glue's drying. I show my little flower garden and everything out there. And you see my little uh, camper. And I think I got two of those. One for in here, one for... But anyways, this right here... I don't have anything in here to demonstrate it, but... This right here sticks to the back of like if you have a KitchenAid or if you have a crock pot or any kind of appliance that has a long cord and it's always in the way and you wish you had a way of doing it without, you know, pulling them up without them laying everywhere when you put them in the, in the closet and stuff. This, you, you stick it on the, I'm going to open it up because you can't see through the flash. You put these on. There's the sticky thing, and it's a 3M sticky thing. But you put that on there, and on the back of whatever it is, let's say it's a crock pot toaster. Well, a toaster, the sides get kind of hot, don't they? Well, something that's not hot, okay? So you would want to put that on there, and then you can wrap your, your cord around, and then it's got a little thing right here. For you to finish it off with. Let's see if it will do it. See? So it comes in a pack of three and that's how um, I'm, I've got a lot of gadgets, cooking gadgets in there and things that the you can't all, you can't, well it's not going to go back in that one, that one's ripped up so We'll just put it back in this for now. And see, I've got enough to where I can do it. Do a couple with uh, some of the things I have in the RV because I have a little rice cooker. Okay, let's see. Another leather bracelet. Don't you love their their jewelry? Is legit. I mean, it's nice. Nice. I'm trying to get it out of the thing. Come on. <laughs> Let's get it out. And it will go on like this. Oh, I love the smell of leather. <sighs> Saddles. I love it. Who doesn't love going in a saddle store and loves the leather smell? This one may be mine. I'm sorry, youngins, but I love leather bracelets. And look at Look at the design on there. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. And they're not much, I mean, they're very affordable. And that's leather. You can smell it, it smells so good. Did I let you see that good enough? I'm sorry. It has this beautiful Celtic or flourish to it. And it has the I just, I love it. And I got another, you've seen these in some of the others. Um, sea turtle necklace. And this one comes on a black chain. And see it, the chain, you have, you, you put, obviously put it on the chain, but you see the little sea turtle, it's black. Love it. Don't you just love that? Wonderful. I'm going to put that on its thing and I can put it in later. Okay, I've got a shirt here that I'm going to try and see if it will fit me. I didn't know about their sizes, how their sizes will go. I think this will work. Yep, it's going to work. Don't you just love it? And it's that cool, um, 
material, that cool, it feels good on. I love that. And it's so bright and pretty. And if you, I hate to even say it, if you have a lot of depression, make sure that you're not wearing dark clothing, okay? Um, when I did my artwork in, in high school, I wore a lot of colorful clothes. My art teacher would point out to me uh, the colors I used in my painting ended up that it, it was like the colors I wore. And he said, see, I mean, she said, see that, that has influenced your painting, the color that you had on. So it also influences how you feel that day. If you feel bad or if you feel just having one of those sad days, get you out some bright colored clothes and put those on and then go find something fun. Go sit beside your flowers outside. Go buy some flowers. Make a little flower bouquet or just find something happy. Find an old classic movie that you love. Oh my gosh, there's days where I just feel like I want to watch an old movie and I want to have some tea or popcorn and, you know, those kind of days. I need to do a video on some of the um, classic movies that I like to watch. That is a, may, is a must see. I should have a list. Make a list on here for y'all and y'all can um, check it off as you see them and you can tell me in the comments below in, you know, uh, how you liked it. I would love to get dialogue where we talk about some of our old movies that we like. Now this is a um, tank top. Look at this, it's so pretty. It's water bubbles. I don't know how you can see it with all the wrinkles. But it's got water bubbles. Can you tell how pretty that is? It's got the wrinkles in it. Maybe the back. Let's see the back better. But I love these colorful. This looks like this one. Um, so I'm I'm loving it. That's gonna fit. Beach wear, beach wear, beach wear. Is it for the beach? I'm just going to throw this one down there and put it in with this one to take it into the bedroom later. Okay. All right. Let's see. I've got some. I'm just going to try to grab the big things first. Okay. This one. Um, <laughs> why is that order stuff? And I can't remember what it was. This is obviously something. Oh. Okay, work with me. Work with me here. Get in there. Come on. You can do it. There we go. It's for spoons. And the lid of whatever you've took off the stove and you can put it here and it can drip here and you put your spoons on there and then that cleans off real easy and it can go in the dishwasher you just take that thing out and put it in the dishwasher if I don't break it so yeah that's what that's for watch me knock that off let's not knock that off okay I'm going to get all these little things and put them out here so we can run through them. Oh my goodness, i got a lot of little stuff. There's another one of these bracelets. You can see through the, the plastic. Right there. Another one like the one on my arm. Then i got more of these, these type bracelets. Boho bracelets is what they call them. And it attaches to the to this little 
button at the end. I'm trying to turn it around so you can see what it looks like. It's really pretty. And I've had that. I've already bought that in another one. And here's an, uh, um, in another unboxing. You can see this one is a diamond shape. And then here's another um, leather bracelet, another type of leather bracelet. I'm telling you, this is so hard to part with to take to my booth. But my goodness, look at this. And it will go around like this. And it's it's a butterfly, but it's a, a, a three-link type. And this is the way that it closes right here. I'll have to figure out how that does. Oh, okay. You hook it. Let's see if I can get it to do it. You hook it. See that little hook in there? You hook it in there, and then you pop it closed like that. Okay, and I have a blue one of that same design. And I'm gonna, okay, everything's went around to the back. Okay, I'll let you see that. See how that looks. Make sure it's not covering up. Same. And I'll just put them over there with that. Over there. Alright, and there is a silver sea turtle. Because see I got I got the other colors, the real bright, the, the other bright colors. And this I just wanted to get the the regular colors because some people don't want bright. They just want just the regular, you know. Do the sea turtles. Everybody loves sea turtles. Love sea turtles. Okay, now these things right here, I got several of these. And what they are is these little caps. If you notice, they look like little bottle caps. But they go, they're supposed to snap onto canned drinks to keep the gnats out of. When you're not drinking it, you, you just snap it on there for the RV, again, camping. Um, and these are the same, same. I got several because, oh, and this one has an X on it. This is the same leather bracelet, but it has that X on it. Love it. And it's black. There's another one of the multicolor ones with a tree on the end, if it will do it. But you've seen those. All right. This another. This is a blue one. Another of the bottle cap things. It's a blue one. Um, get all these little things. There's a purple one. Bottle cap. I mean, it's a can topper for canned drinks. Love that new, um, what is that new lemon lime? Snappy or, oh my gosh, now that I've tr said it, I can't get my brain to say it. To, I can't think of it now. But I love the zero sugar drinks and stuff. This is a collar that lights up blue for Arctic. I'm going to try to bring, take my, um, white Labrador with me and that will be good to have on his neck when we go to the beach and what you know if we're walking at the dark in dark so here's another one of these this is for the, the RV um, just gonna put all these little things down because we'll go through them pretty quickly okay now this this is for my little granddaughter who just got that baby doll everybody loves when I unboxed it. This was a set of how many? One, two, three, four, 
support little outfits for her little baby doll. And she sits it up like it's sitting up and laughing at everybody. I, know, I need to open it up. And it freaks her daddy out. <laughs> She'll be sitting it up in a chair. Look, a little headband. Little headband. And little outfit for the little doll. Isn't that the cutest thing? She's going to love it. Okay. All right, let's just put that right here. Yeah, I've got a lot to go through. Now let's see what this one is. This is way cheaper than, um, more affordable, I should say, not cheap. Um, for, like a little swimsuit or, or ballerina little suit. Hopefully that will fit. That one, I think it should fit that little baby. You can see the little bird and the little, little skirt that goes with it. Isn't that cute? So that way she has some little clothes that she can put on and off the little baby. She has really took care of that little, little baby. She has loved on that little baby and takes it and rocks it and just holds it and loves it. it just, she just loves that little baby. Okay, you're probably hearing our TV. My husband got home. <laughs> um, another one of the little headbands. And this is a little shirt and some little pants. Isn't that cute? Little pokey dot pants. Little shirt with a little bunny on it. We love it. We love... I can't say that enough. I have been really happy with all the things that I get from Timu. Um, I hope I'm not talking too low for you. I noticed in some of my videos it sounds like I'm yelling. And I'm trying to remember to use my auto gain. A lot of people, if you're watching some of their videos, they'll be talking like normal. You can hear them okay. And then they're, they'll add music or an intro with music. And it just about knocks you out your chair. They haven't learned that audio gain. There's an audio gain um, function that you can do to a clip that you're adding to your video, which is music or any kind of clip. If it's got talking or whatever, you can right click on that clip and go to clip and go audio gain or um, if it has audio gain right there, you can you can get it from there, but you need to go minus to take some of the 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 sound down if it's just too sharp, real scary sharp. So that's just a little tip for me. If you do um, videos, if you're editing videos, you need to do remember your audio gain so you don't knock people out of the chair whenever you're music comes on and this is little pants and little shirt <laughs> they're so cute and they're just as as seamed and t uh, stitched just like real clothes just like the re real thing they're just tiny so yeah she's gonna love it little scarlet Isaac's all into toll, uh, cars and things like that, and it ain't, it ain't hard to find that stuff. They got boy stuff everywhere. Okay, I'm just gonna pull everything out. Okay, we've seen that. There's some rings. Okay. Okay, is that all? Yep, that's all. Okay, now, let's see. There's another one of those cans, uh, toppers to keep the gnats out. I can't stand gnats and bugs. I can't stand it if they get in. As I was saying before my battery died, 
<laughs> um, let me back you up a little bit. I need to back up a little bit. I feel like I'm not having to do this to get into the viewfinder. Um, I can't stand bugs in my food. I can't. I mean, nobody should like bugs in their food. But yeah, so that's one reason why I want these things so we can put. I can put over uh, my my can, and I can use cupcake liners. I can actually poke a hole for a straw and put a cup cupcake liner down over my thing but I like this because it actually seals it they can't walk up under and get in another sea turtle um, I'm gonna go through the things you've already saw don't seen these and I'm just gonna go ahead and put that that's more the turquoise the turquoise leather and then another one of these. This one is the, the one that has the cylinders that feels so good on your arm. You just do this number. Yeah, um, that you already seen. And then they had a U, three USB charger here that I love because we have this area on our, um, we only have two outlets in our little RV one is across the dinette and you don't and i have a cpap and i <laughs> i need one of the the plugins to be for my my cpap so um this i liked it because it was horizontal i can actually put it in the top or the bottom well probably the top um outlet spot and we're able to charge our phones here I like that it was horizontal. See? That's why I got that one. You think, well, why? I mean, you can get these anywhere. Well, what much? What much? And it's going to be handy. So, another RV item. Camper. And let's see. What is this thing? Okay, this is a little hook. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. I'm gonna have to, so you can see it. This is a hook that, I think it goes like this. Okay, I can hang things to dry in the camper, okay? I have a lot of handles that I can put that in, and then I have a, a rack in my bathroom that I can hang this on too for uh, wet washcloths, wet towels, things like that, that I can um, hang that. And if it's raining outside, I can bring stuff in and hang. Just, I mean, it's not many things. Of course, it's just four little things, but you know, it's still handy dandy, you know. Uh, not something over down there. Oh, it's a piece of, just nothing. Um, and I haven't gotten the metal. Let me see. Turquoise bracelets, and I haven't got these before. So, and usually whenever they say it's turquoise. You have to be careful. A lot of places it will be uh, halite that has been dyed to look like turquoise. Um, so that may be what this is. We're not sure. But it's really pretty, whatever it is. You see the buckle, I mean the little clasp at the back. You can see the feather there. And then we have the this. It says it's turquoise, so I'm going to trust them, but I'm pretty sure that this is probably halite, you know, that is uh, dyed, but that's okay. You don't have to, I'm not going to say it's genuine, you know, I'm just going to say turquoise color, and it's still just as pretty because I have people that love, uh, I get, I have turquoise colored sea glass and things like that. Everybody loves it too. It doesn't have to be real genuine turquoise I mean 
watch it and enjoy it. I mean, you know, you know what I mean. Everything's always, oh, it's got to be real diamonds. It's got to be real this. It's got to be real that. Not all the time. There's some good stuff out there that ain't genuine. Um, sorry about that. I'm being a little bit, oh, pet peeves. You know, pet peeves. Everybody's got a pet peeve. Okay, I have a ring here. And these are... Oh my goodness, how cute is this? This one is an adjustable. And look at what it does. Let's see. It spins. Do you see it? It spins as you move, and it's one of those that wraps around your finger, so you can open it up, and you can put it on your finger. And <laughs> I love it. Don't you just love that? It just spins, and it's a little, um, it's a little bee and a flower. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I think that one's for me. <laughs> I've got two more. I got two more. <laughs> I got two more. It'll be okay. <laughs> I'm gonna end up keeping everything. <laughs> and see if you do and see Anna left and that's her little axolotl necklace I got for her. And she left. Oh let her see. oops, there went the chain. They don't never put, they don't never, they don't never ever put the chain back on, I mean, the, on, on the pendant. <laughs> they don't put the chain back on, or on it, when they ship it. But that's the little axolotl. And she loves, 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 loves those. And it come with its own little... Little chain. Now, where did I put the little... Okay, there it goes. Oh, no, it's this one. <sighs> Hope you don't feel like I'm, like, speeding through this too fast. I don't know. Sometimes I feel like I have to hurry. I don't know. I get in these hurry, 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 hurry type. And that's Anna. So I'm going to put it right there. Don't watch this brain. Forget it. And I'll, I'll see it two years from now. And I'll say, hmm, I thought that ran. I never did give it to her. And now here is the kitty cat. This little multi kitty cat. See, I gotta have some things for people that love things like that. You know, I gotta have some things like that. Some chew, I have some, I have all kinds of different things available in my booth for different ages, different people, and, and things like that, that like different things. Some people like a lot of little stuff, and then some people like, like my mom, she, I mean, she loves the little dainty stuff. Um, but some people, and there's another sterling uh, turtle, sea turtle, and I got, Another one of the, that's another one of the little kitty cats that I just showed you. I'll show you again. You can see how pretty. Little, man, a little kitty kitty with all her bling bling. Looks like a diamond painter should be wearing stuff like this right here. Because we love, 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 love um, bling and glittery stuff. So there's two of those. I didn't mean to show you two things of the same thing. There's another one. And let's see. Here's a ring. See, that little ring just keeps on moving. It just moves. The air. Oh, I love it. Oh, my gosh. I love it. Now, these right here will sell out. I'm telling you. They will be gone. And here's a cat. Remember that uh, if you saw me, the think it was last box, the fourth unboxing, the fourth Timu order that I have. 
I had a lot of owls, but here's a kitty cat ring with the pretty eyes. See the pretty eyes. So if you like kitty cats, and it is a sizable, so you can pull it apart and it, it will, it's sizable. So people will like that. Sometimes it's good to have little sizable rings. Not everything doesn't always fit, you know. Another kitty cat ring. Another of my little flower turning rings. See? See how it turns? And as you move. I don't know. It's not focusing for some reason. You can turn it. And as you, you move, it'll turn. Another one of those. It's a little bee on one side, flower on the other. Just showed you that. I just had to show you again. I just had to show you again. <laughs> I'm so excited over it. Another axolotl, but this is um, a darker one, I think it's an axolotl, or is this a mouse? I can't tell. I think it's an axolotl. No, it might be a mouse. We'll see. Let's see, and it, co it does come with its own, with a chain. So tell me what you think that is. Is that a mouse? Or is that an axolotl? Really cute. Okay. Put that right there. All right, now I've got three of these, four of these, and I'm just going to show the one. Let's see. These are for men. You can see it has a heavier necklace, and women, if they like these things. And we've got a little crimp going here. Come on now. Okay, let's cooperate, cooperate. I will have to fix that chain. It's wanting to get um, messed up there. Okay, may have to put that on a cord if I can't get that fixed. But it is a, an axe. I'll turn it around and see what's on it. See, that's pretty, it's really nice. Really nice. And I've got three of those and I'll fix that chain later. Cause I can get in my, I can really look under my magnifying glass. What is this one? Is this another cat? That's another cat ring. Here's a whale ring. Let's see here. This is sort of a cuff. And you open it up and you can put it on, you know. Let's see. Okay, I need to open it up a little more. And get it on my arm and then to gently put it back and you can see it's whale's tail you see the whale's tail really nice really nice isn't it nice love it so that's gonna go in the boo for me, keep it. We don't know. We shall see. If it don't sell, guess whose it is? Mine. <laughs> <laughs> and my brother does uh, sells um, Dam Damascus knives that someone from that, uh, what is it, TV show where they make the knives? They forged, forged in steel or something like that. Well, I noticed that they had a set of Damascus little axes and, and knives. I'm going to take a little moment here to get them out. And, I, and they come with a little keychain in it. See, it has its own little keychain thing. You can see that. So, um, and it's a little set. Uh, I love these. I'm just, I don't want to lose the, 
I may just put them all in one big one, big pack, okay? But anyways, open these things up. They're different sizes. It's a, the, They all come in one, you get four, okay, in one pack with the keychains. Now, I haven't put the keychain on. It goes to the little, you know, inserted in this, I, I'm guessing. But I want you to look at these, see if I can hold them. If I can get them all together, I may have to use two hands. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> they have their little, it's axes or butcher knives or whatever, <laughs> little teeny tiny, and they have their own little, their own little uh, thing to put it in. <laughs> I'm going to, have to take these up there and show my brother. He may want to get these and to offer them in his booth to have something little to, uh, to show. And I'm going to open them up. They're going to be little knives. And I don't think that they're sharp. Well, yeah, they're sharp. They're sharpened. They're sharp. You could cut with these. Don't get on an airplane with these folks because they get you. <laughs> So I'm going to show you this one. <laughs> They're supposed to be Damascus, but you know, eh, I don't know if it is or not. But look at this, isn't that the cutest thing? <laughs> that is the cutest thing. And they go in their little, their little, <laughs> <laughs> Am I doing it wrong, y'all? I must be doing it wrong. Am I doing it? I don't know. No, I'm doing it wrong. I'm... Okay. And then that goes across. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> there we go. And that's how that goes. And there, here are two more. One's an axe. Whip this out. <laughs> these are stocking stuffers for men. I'm telling you people, if you can get a hold of these, it's not wanting to focus the stupid phone, the stupid, I almost said phone, um, camera. Um, if you have four men to buy for in your family that like knives, Stocking stuffers. You could give one per each person. <laughs> I'm loving this. Did I put that in the right one? I may not have. I think this one goes in this one. That's what the problem is. I'm putting them in the wrong, back in the wrong little... Um, Let's see here. I'm hoping I'm putting them in the right ones because, oops, I'm going to make a hole in that. Um, anyways, they're sharp. You have to be careful with these. Uh, let me think. I think this, this one goes in that. No? Okay, this one's so sharp it wants to grab. Let's see here. Do I have it in the right one? I don't want to mess up my little... Okay, there we go. I think that's it. And then this one goes in this. I guess. I hope. I may not have them in the right ones. But anyways, yeah. Don't we just love these? Oh my gosh. My brother's my brother's gonna go insane. He's gonna say those are cool. Buy me a couple of those to put in my booth so I can sell them. <laughs> if they still have them. Sometimes they um, sell out of stuff really quickly. What they have here in, a, in America in their warehouse here that they're able to send to you quick that's why they can 
they have a warehouse here is what I've read that they can send things to you very quickly because it's here in the States rather than waiting for it to come from China. They already have their stuff here, so they put it on their website. And what you see on the website, that's why things sell out so quickly, is because the prices are so good and because they already have things here. They only have so much here in their website, in their warehouse. So if you see a deal, put it in your cart. Get it when you can. If you spend, if you spend normal, uh, someone told me last week, that if you spend, if you bought, bought something that was full price and it had went down within 30 days, I think, they refund you the difference and it'll be a credit in your cart. I'm thinking is what they said. Now, I will have to check that out to see. And if you, if you have had that, comment below and let us know if you've, had, if you've noticed that. So that'll be a good good thing to know. Um, also, they have coupons that if you spend like fifty dollars, if you order thirty dollars, fifty dollars, you'll get a credit that you can use on your next order for, let's say, you get an item for free or forty percent off your next order that you purchase something in, and you know they they're constantly doing things like that. So. Check your prices. I always go to Amazon and say, okay, can I get this cheaper at Amazon? And if, is this the normal price? You know, that type of thing. So um, be savvy. And when you see a deal, get the deal. Okay, don't wait on it because they will sell out pretty quickly. So with that said, I want to thank you so much for watching this video tell me what you thought was really interesting to you and if you have something that you have gotten one of these things items and it worked good or if it didn't work good leave it in the comment comments below <sighs> remember jesus loves you i love you i'm sending you mental hugs and praying for each and every one of you out there whether you love jesus or not i'm gonna pray to jesus on your behalf all of you for taking time out of your day to watch my channel. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit your notification bell button so that way the more videos that I post, you'll see right away that I've posted new ones. So anyways, um, the next video I'm going to be doing is cutting and, I mean, trimming my, a diamond painting and gluing it to a stretched canvas. I'm doing an updated version because I, the last one, um, people said it was hard to hear me, and that was because I was on, I was recording with my iPad, and it didn't have that good a microphone, and it was kind of over there while I was over here in the light, and people had a hard time hearing me. I could have turned it up with the audio gain, like I said about, I could have turned it up plus something with the audio game had I known back then, but that was when I just started out and I'm learning a lot more about how to, how to edit videos and do things like that. And I really am so happy that you have stuck around all of you from the very beginning and I love you. Thank you so much. Hugs to each and every one of you and Hugs to you that are new subscribers. I've had a lot of new subscribers come on and say they love the, the what I'm doing and, and things. And thank you so much for your wonderful encouragement. That helps. That helps. It makes my day. Oh, it makes me so happy to, to read all of your great comments and get to know you through YouTube. And, uh, and a lot of you love the Lord. And I appreciate you um, telling me about, about how you love Him and Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's great encouragement. Everybody should be supportive of each other. With all of that said, I'm going to go ahead and let you go. So, be good, everyone. Bye.